right guys, today I have a review on the Urban Decay 24-7 Concealer Pencil and that's what the product looks like. And the shade I'm in is NSA and it's just a pencil concealer like that. The shade itself, um, NSA, that's what it, it looks like right there. And I did get this very similar to my skin tone because of the fact that this is more for spots concealing. So what Urban Decay claims on this is that it's an easy to use concealer. Um, they have different um, skin tones and I'll put how many shades they have available here. I'm pretty sure that they didn't have that big of a shade range. So it's kind of hard to, to have a match for everyone, but it is a stay put matte finish and what it's supposed to be used for is a smudge free application and it's supposed to be used for blemishes or large problem areas that you might have on your face and it's supposed to help you give a flawless con complexion. So it is formulated without any of these which is very nice for people who have problems with any of those on their skin. And what you do is spots conceal with this. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the demo so you can kind of see it in action. I also applied it underneath my eyes so you guys can kind of see what it would look like underneath the eye. Although I don't recommend this for underneath the eye. This really goes really nicely with my skin tone it's really great for spot concealing and I have quite a few blemishes going on right now I am at that time of the month so this was the perfect time to do um, spot concealing videos on concealers that are good for that so I thought I'd go ahead and show demos on them so you guys can see why I use these concealers and how I use them um, for under the eyes I feel like this isn't that great it's not as um, smooth you can't directly put this underneath your eye and smooth it out it kind of cakes underneath the eye it's more of a thicker formula because it's more of a spot concealer so I recommend this if you're um, looking for a concealer to hide really well blemishes and if you have a problem area or a birthmark or something that you do not like and you want it concealed then this concealer is absolutely fabulous it's a matte finish it blends really nicely um, what I usually do is either apply it before or after my foundation I really feel like especially after the foundation it works really nicely you just apply it directly on the spot and then use your finger to blend it in and then apply a little bit of powder on it and it will stay put most of the day. Um, I think that every time I use this, it usually lasts, I would say as, as long as you set it with powder, it would probably last you like eight to nine hours without it moving anywhere unless you're super sweaty and things like that, then it's probably gonna last a lot less. But I really like this for spots concealing. If you have problem areas, it's a really nice concealer to have. It is a little steep and a little bit on the high end, but I have yet to find a drugstore concealer that will live up to this. So I absolutely love this when I'm having problem areas and um, I need concealing on acne marks or anything like that, or if I have a a scar or anything like that this really really is helpful so let me know if you guys like this if you hate it if you've used it underneath your eye area I don't recommend it for underneath the eye area like I said but for spot concealing I'd love to know your opinion what you love about it what you hate about it and yeah um thank you guys so much for watching for subscribing and until next time bye guys